guys welcome back with me Cindy Compare and today I want to spot the difference between real and fake pairs of Nike KD17 let's check it out as you can see at the first glance on the marking area here so look at on the authentic one between the cage and the the midsole is connect however on the fake one the line here is definitely off way to the right on the cage it's obviously clear that there is a white glue stain right on top of the midsole next one you can see still same between the plastic here and the midsole here it isn't connect it's very off looking terrible however on the authentic one it's looking good it's connect another one also as you can see the blue plastic here isn't fully attached to the midsole on the fake one here whereas on the authentic one here it's looking so perfect another one also as you guys can see so the the shape of the cage here is definitely bigger on the fake one compared to the authentic one and also there is a white glue stain still same right on top of the midsole another one also as you guys can see so the placement of the cage and the plastic on the midsole here is definitely off another one also as you guys can see the cage here is slightly go down it's almost unseen however on the authentic one you can see here so the placement of the cage here is very perfect it's looking so good moving to the inside part of the shoes on the marking area here is very clear there is a white glue stain it's looking terrible this is the main problem that you can find mostly on the fake one the glue stain here is looking so terrible another sample also still the same you can see the cage here the plastic is slightly go down slightly lower compared to the authentic one here it's a little bit higher and also this one the placement of the cage is slightly to the left it's looking very off it's looking terrible it's very easy to understand looking from above here as you guys can see on the two box it's quite similar definitely it's but it's the yellow gradient here it's more likely thicker on the fake one compared to the authentic one also the kd logo here as you guys can see the stitches around the kd logo the stitches on the left is too narrow there is no gap here however on the authentic one the stitches is all around it like it has a proper gap Moving to the back of the shoes, as you guys can see, the KB Duran letter here is slightly go down. It touched the outsole here. However, on the authentic one, there is a little bit gap between the K letter and the outsole. Another sample also, as you guys can see, this looking terrible. It's not on the middle. It's slightly to the right. I don't know how they make, make this one, but it's looking it's terrible. Another one also, as you guys can see, this one is slightly to the left. The KB Duran letter is slightly to the left isn't centered it should be centered like the authentic one here another one also still same looking terrible this one is slightly to the right you will notice the most is the spacing between two stitches you can see on my pointer here on the edge here is very looking narrow however on the authentic one the gap on the stitches is looking very good and the last one is the outsole as you guys can see maybe the air trouble here looking very transparent on the fake one compared to the authentic one and also this one's looking terrible so much bigger than the authentic and it's too transparent compared to the authentic one here we cannot see the struggle at all all right guys that is the explanation i know i've been missing for a few months because i got six however now i'm back so on the next day i will keep to make another video as much as possible thank you for waiting for me I'm really sorry and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. So thank you very much for watching and see you on the next video.